Yo, yo, how we doing, people? How are we doing? It's your boy Malik, and coming to you with a new lighting setup. Haha! -ha. Just got home, just got to the crib, raced here, new packages, new equipment. Yeah. So, if for those who don't know, you know, Malik Shot Motion Productions. I have recently aligned myself on a path of product, cinematography, and branding. So right now, all the work that you see me putting out is either brand work or product work. And the difference between product and brands is very, very, uh, very, very little. So products, you know, you get the product, you set it up, you shoot it, your creativity, a whole bunch of things go into that, right? But with something with a brand, is usually capturing the aesthetic and the feel of like what that brand is, you know, something like an interview of someone interviewing about like their products or their lifestyle or a service that they may provide, you know, and that's the really the difference between the products and the branding. But that's what I'm doing right now. It's like my main focus. I still do all that the cool stuff, but because I'm doing a lot of brand work, I need two camera setup. And this is why we are here. Now, I have a box of goodies. Before I get into it, I got some other cool stuff. Now, I opened this in the car because my door was acting crazy. She's in the box, she thought it was gifts. So I'll let her open it up. Uh, this external hard drive. So I got me you know, a nice little external hard drive. You know, I'm gonna put it there. I don't know if you can uh, focus up. I'm trying to do like the YouTuber thing. <laughs> I don't know if it's focused or not, but yeah. So it's external hard drive. Another two terabytes. I've been taking on a lot of projects. I've been shooting on a lot of 4K. And right now I'm gonna be taking on a project with a couple of brands, two brands, and I need to just have a designated drive for them. So I'll pick this up right there. So it's gonna be there all the time, ready to go. Now, something I really needed, uh, I fell into the trap of getting like, oh, 125 uh, gigabyte SD card. Oh, fantastic. It's not. They're horrible, they shut off. Take them with the 64s. So boom, got me two 64s right here. As I read it off, I don't know if you can see it. I don't know if it's gonna focus or not. So we got Extreme Pro right here, 64 gigabyte, reads up to 170 megabytes per second. Boom. So right now I got two 65s, I got 125. I'll throw this one right into the bag. Leave this one right at home just in case. Boom. You always need to make sure you have extra storage. SD cards and batteries, baby, go a long way. Now, let's get back to what we are here for. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. My B camera. Oh, here we go. Is it gonna focus? I'm not sure. It's on autofocus. Oh, I'm not, a, I'm not a YouTuber, I don't know. Let's put it back here. Okay, cool. So this baby right here is, uh, oh, I'm in focus? Okay, cool. It's a Panasonic. G7K 4K. Boom. So right now what I'm shooting on, my Panasonic GH5X Lumix. The lens I'm using right now is just one of my like pancake lenses. It's a 14 mil. It's always something nice to have in a bag, especially if I have my office in a tight space as you can see. So I throw on the 14 for this. But like I said, products and brands, I've been asked to do a lot of interviews about, you know, talking about people's brands and talking about products and they want it shot in a certain style. They wanted a two camera style. And I'm like, yeah, dope, because this is like what I started started in. In school, was, everything's very like studio set up. So I'm like all gun ho, but I really couldn't do it with like one camera, you know what I'm saying? So now with this camera, I'm, this is the first time I'm opening it, by the way. This will definitely allow me to do that. Now, I was searching for another camera. I wanted to get, you know, an S1 or SH1, you know, one day, one day. I'm hoping for the next six months to a year, I'm getting that camera. You know, I'm just gonna keep working mad hard and I'm gonna get that. So uh, as we move along, I'm like, I need a camera that can help me achieve that look and that aesthetic and that's really on par with my GH5S without getting another GH5S and something that's really for the low low. So then, oh no, I'm talking so much. Ooh. Here we go, oh, out the back, oh, oh no. It's like candy. Oh, this is cute. 
Yo, this is fantastic. Like, oh man, look, I'm gonna check it out here. You can see, I don't know if you can see it or not. Like I said, it's my pancake lens, it's on auto. I've never done this before, I'm not a YouTuber, guys. Okay, so this is the camera, I hope you can see it. It's pretty dope. I'm gonna try to do the whole like solo shot thing. Oh, it's not working, whatever. This is what we're getting, haha. <laughs> so, it's very lightweight. It's very lightweight. It reminds me of like a little baby GH5S. Like it's like the little tiny brother. You know what I'm saying? Uh, so the specs on this right here. So it shoots up to 4K. Um, from what I've been looking up and looking at, it's really good for taking pictures. So that could be really good too for me to be taking pictures on the side when I'm doing actual uh, product photography and when I'm shooting uh, for different uh, products. So that is fantastic. What I really was getting this for is because it shoots 4k up to 30 frames so it shoots 24 frames and 30 frames 4k and that's what i really needed for and then it does shoot 60 frames a second at 1080p which is fantastic so it's like a nice little pickup i got it for about uh 550 it's a nice little pickup to extremely boost my production it's going to produce boost my production by leaps and bounds so allow me to do like two things at once get a main shot get a side shot and like i said that's gonna allow me to just really play and be more dynamic and every single thing i do now from like the products the branding music videos step shows dance routines all the cool little side artistic stuff that i do on the side it's about to be summertime i'm probably gonna have this out with me uh, at all the car meets and stuff like that for, to, to, get, to, uh, to take pictures but yeah, uh, let's keep going in the bag. I know I've just been rambling a, a bunch. Uh, what else it comes with? It comes with a nice little, you know, little GH band. I might even use this one this time. Who knows? Throw it right in the box. Okay, let's see what's next. Okay, a nice little cap cover. Nice little cap cover, hood. Hood cap cover, sweet, sweet. Oh yes, it comes with Oh, I forgot. I wasn't even thinking about it. Oh, where is it on this lens? It comes with a 14 to 42 kit lens, which is pretty nice. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, for exactly what I need it for, what I'm probably going to do is I'm going to keep my 25 prime lens on here on my GH5S and then strap on my build tracks and put the 50 on to here, put the 50 on to here. But definitely, I'm going to see you check this out see what this is about i'm gonna give you like a full breakdown soon but like the whole camera soon but right now just sh sh me unboxing straight up unboxing nice this is it's cute this is cute and like yo the end body stabilization is great on this camera from what, was, what i've been reading i love it let's see what else comes in here oh Typical battery, battery charger, pack extra wires. Nice, nice, nice. Let's see the battery. Oh, it's a different battery. It's a smaller battery than my GH5S. That's interesting. Cool. You need to get another one of these small little jumps. These small little jumpers. But hey, let's uh pair this up real quick. Let's take the cap off. Like this, it feels like a toy. And all honestly, this feels like, a, it feels like a little toy. It feels like a toy. I love it. I love how like, it's super light. I love it. I love how light it is. It's, uh, I don't know, it's, it's get me out of it. And let's make it all about you. Let's bring it a little closer, let's see. Uh, like it's so nice and compact. Even adding, since I have the Viltrox, adding on a heavier lens to this is not going to make the body that much heavier. Just me feeling how light this is. Like, and I think that's what I'm really going to do to maximize this is boom, put the nice fire glass on there. And it's going to, like I said, boost my production value. Leaps and bounds because now I can do more. So, you know, that was my little unboxing, you know, on this journey of Stride Motion Productions. Like I said, I'm gonna do like a whole real review on it. I'm gonna play around with it. Do like, you know, the whole YouTube thing. And uh, yeah. Thanks guys. Thanks for watching. Like, share, subscribe. You know, 
keep looking at me. Keep looking at me. Keep looking at my work. <laughs> keep sharing. And I appreciate you all. Remember, peace, love, happiness. I love you all. Kindness. Spread kindness in the world. Boop, 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 boop. This is I'm gonna start tonight till it's